everyone, welcome to These Cabbies, Dolls, and Toys. I have a very ambitious video for you guys today. I decided that um, I was going to show you guys my entire in-box Bratz collection. I have um, original Bratz, I have Bratz Big Babies, Bratz Babies, Bratz Kids. I even have accessories. This is gonna be awesome. I can't wait to share all of this stuff with you guys. Yeah, and I know many of you love the Bratz. Many of you that watch me love the Bratz as much as I do, so this should be a lot of fun. <music> Welcome back, you guys. So first, I want to start by saying that MGA first released the Bratz in 2001. It was a, a it was a very fresh idea. It was to compete with Barbie. Um, it, I guess that was like a rumor for a long time, but it's pretty much confirmed. <laughs> it was to compete with Barbie, and they did a fantastic job. And I love Barbie, and we all love Barbie, but most of us love the Bratz. So let's 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 be real. Um, they Barbie with an edge. I say that all the time and that's that's what they are to me. They're Barbie with an edge and They're great, you know the big full lips and the sassy Outfits and they just they're sassy and they're fierce and they're wonderful and they're the brats and there's nothing else out there like them um, and There are things that are a little similar but the brats came first they were here first before L-O-O-M-G before Rainbow High they started this whole thing so yeah I love the rats I could go on raving about it forever but I'm not gonna bore you with that um I guess there's a lot to show you um and I'm, I guess I'm just gonna wing it and see how it goes in 2007 MGA released the very first Bratz kids and I'm so happy that they did as you can see, I love the Bratz Kids. It is the uh, biggest part of my Bratz collection, actually. I mean, that's what I have the most of, is what I'm trying to say. And um, in box and out of box. And I do have some out of box um, of, of the Bratz Kids, but this video is my in box collection. So, yeah, that's what I'm going to show you. And um, you guys have probably already seen a lot of this because I did a video of my Bratz kids, um, I want to say about a year ago. But we're going to do it again for this video, for the sake of this video. I think it's going to be fun. And yeah, you might as well see all of my inbox dolls in this video. Uh, Bratz anyways. I have with me um, the, what I decided to start with um, is the traditional, or um, the original, I'm sorry, not traditional, the original Bratz. Um, some of them are from the original series and two of them here are reproductions of the fr very first Bratz dolls. Um, I, I have all four of the collectors or the 20th anniversary dolls, but I only have two in box. So I guess we'll start with them. Yeah, we'll start with them. So I have, um, this is Chloe's um, 20, 20 year anniversary. And um, she's a reproduction of the original Chloe, and she's absolutely beautiful. She came out in 2021, and Nelson actually found um, her and the other three dolls for me at Hot Topic, and um, I was super excited. So yes, this is a, an exact replica of the original Brad's doll that you know first launched in 2001 and I thought that was really cool I wanted in on this everybody was going crazy looking for these um, and it was it was just a fun time it happened just a couple years ago and I remember it all so well and I definitely needed to get all four which I did but I'm only going to show you um, the two that I have still in box but yes and I love Chloe she's such a great character yeah, I love them all though. I, I can't really pick a favorite when it comes to Bratz. I, I say I do, but then I go, well, but I like her too, but I like her too. So yeah. now I'm going to show you the um, 
20th anniversary jade actually i'm gonna move this out of the way since we already saw her so this is jade and again this is this is what they looked like in in 2001 um 2001 when they first came out they came in a box just like this the, um, they came with extra outfits, everything. Hairbrush, two pairs of snap-on shoes, a brat's backpack, hair accessory, two fashion tops, and two bottoms. And I really meant to take them all out of the box, but I didn't. And now that they're still in the box, I'm thinking that I might keep them this way. Because to be perfectly honest, you guys my doll room gets overwhelming and it depends on the doll it really depends there's a lot of lot of things to factor in but sometimes certain dolls display better in the box and some of them display better out of the box um and it really really depends what they are where i'm going to display them and for some of these dolls that come with all these accessories and stuff if I figure if I unbox them, I'm going to lose everything that they came with. It's very difficult to display them that way. So it's 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 challenging and a lot of these dolls don't come with stands and so that's a whole other thing and it's it's a lot. Moving right along, since um yeah, we have we started off with Chloe and Jade, so now we will take a look at another version of Chloe and Jade and this is hashtag snow kissed this is one of my favorite Bratz editions um and look at how beautiful she is I mean these outfits are so amazing this is back in the early 2000s you know so I'm really really impressed with I can't really say I know the quality because they're in the boxes, but they just, it looks rich. Like it looks like it's really good quality. So that's the back of the box. Um, bundle up for hashtag snow fun, hashtag burr. Um, it comes with stickers that you can put on the snowboard. So there's a lot that these came with. Um, snowboard, um, snow goggles, snow boots zhuzhi floopy hats and, and and scarves and it's just a fun fun series so this is hashtag snow kiss jade and this is hashtag snow kiss chloe and although chloe looks amazing um in this i i feel like i like jade's i mean it's pretty much the same aesthetic to be honest but i like jade's um version better and i think it's because she's got the dark hair and it just looks so nice with the white um it's, it's just i don't know it just looks a little it catches your eye a little more i think but chloe looks fabulous too and this is the back of her box awesome okay i also have a couple of um outfits fashion packs that are still in the box too you guys may have seen these in another video but these are fun i don't know ex the exact year that these came out um and it looks like they won a, a a toddy toy of the year pretty awesome i'm assuming that these came out shortly after the brats so now we have this is interesting this is um the brats this is called brats designed by chloe and it actually comes with a perfume that is for you um and it says chloe uses her spirited stomp to set the runway in motion brats designed by chloe so that's the back of the box and um since this is coming off anyways we'll get a better look at her she is fierce look at that she looks like a runway model. She really does. This is so awesome with all the accessories. And then, you know, the fact that they added a perfume is pretty cool. I wouldn't use it at this point um, <laughs> because it's been way, way too many years. Two complete looks. The outfit that she has on is just amazing. It's a le Well, it's not, I'm assuming it's not real leather, but 
supposed to be leather. And she's got her fashion bags and her extra pair of feet, which I always thought that was funny how they come with feet. So they, they don't come with shoes. They have no feet. So you snap their feet on and the feet happen to have painted shoes on, you know. So it, it's just, it's, it's funny. It's funny to me. I always laugh every time. But it's cool. I think it's cool, too. And, and to be honest, it's a lot easier to change their shoes that way. I think, personally. All right. So that is that. Bratz designed by Chloe. Now, the last one for the original Bratz series is um, Bratz, the fashion show. And this is Yasmin. And I love the pink dress that she's wearing. I love the little um jersey jacket you know with the fur trim and and yeah been such a pretty doll you know she just is no matter what edition she's in she just looks beautiful it says brilliant style strutting their stuff on the fashion stage this is the back all right now um next in line is brat's babies brat's uh babies Breath Babies were the next in line uh, after the original launch. Um, and what I have here, this is um, Brad's Baby Boys. Forgive me, I don't know the exact year that he came out, but this is Brad's Baby Boys, and this is Cameron. And it says, step back in time and step out in style with the Bratz Boys and see how it all began as they expressed that super cool sense of style and kick back with the Bratz Boys, Cameron. So that's the back and he comes with a football and um looks like like a little fireball but he comes with actual cloth um clothes on and the reason i'm saying that is because um there were editions that had snap-on clothes and you guys are going to see that next so 2005 was when the brats big babies came out and um, the first one is, so I believe this is the original one that came out in 2005. And this is Yasmin, and she comes with her little pet frog. Um, it says, Bratz Big Baby, sometime is fun time, especially with cool new sun fun fashions. Now, I don't know the exact year, but I know that they started making the big babies in 2005. And... Um, it says now with real hair, which is telling me, yeah, that, that this is probably not the first edition. Yeah. Um, so cute bonus pet style certificate. Yeah. She is so cute. I love that red color that they use with the white. It just looks so nice with her complexion or hair. Super cute. The back. She comes with a brush, so it's so fun. All right, now the pampered, the pampered pups came out a few years after, um, and yeah, so she has her little. It looks like a chihuahua. Um, it says exclusive. Introducing Shiloh. I'm soft and my head turns. Adopt and register your pup online. Oh, okay. So you could at the time register the pup online so this is chloe and she's the brats big babies pampered pups so cute they look adorable as as babies they really really do i love the outfit she's wearing and she's barefoot they're barefoot too i noticed and they even have manicured toes look at that so so cute all right so now it is time to introduce you to the kids. The kids um, were the last, well, not the last, but it was it was the last little line of the brats to, to come out. Yeah, I hope I said that right. You know what I mean. The Bratz kids actually came out in 2006. I originally thought it was 2007, but it's 2006. They ran for a couple of years and they came out with a lot of fun stuff. So I'm going to start over here. This is the Bratz Kids uh, Horseback Fun. And um, I, so I have three of these in the box. But I do have one to show you out of the box. 
So um, I have two Yasmin, and this is the one um, that I took out, and she's very, very cute. Um, I have her displayed with these on the shelf. Um, she's adorable, absolutely adorable. She's got her bucket of apples for the horse, and um, as you can see, a very, very cute little outfit. So even though this video is for inbox dolls, um, I just, because I have so many of the horseback fun, I thought it would be nice to just show you what they look like out of the box. With that being said, she came with a lot of accessories and um, this kind of supports what I was telling you guys um, that in some cases, it makes sense to keep them in the box. Even though she's very cute, she doesn't come with a stand. Um, it's very hard to display her because of that. And I lost a lot of her accessories already because it's just really hard to keep track of everything, uh, for me anyways. So um, when they come like this and you can display them just like that and you can see everything that they come with and everything is together and the package itself is really cute. I just think that it displays really nicely and I know we're all different kind of collectors some of us collect only in box some of us won't dare have a, a doll in a box and some do what I do which is a little bit of both it's all good it's all about what you like it's it's perfect it's a personal preference when it comes to doll collecting and that's what's so great about it because it's all yours but with that being said, look at how cute she looks in the packaging. This is the uh, Bratz Kids Horseback Fun Dana. And um, she just looks adorable. I like her second outfit. Probably a little more even than the one she's wearing because you know I love pink. She comes with a little bag. And um, she has two complete outfits including her riding boots. Look at how cute are those little pink riding boots. And then there's artwork on the back. So nice. They did a really good job with the packaging with, with just about everything that I'm about to show you. Now this is Chloe. First back one, Chloe. Her outfits, they, each of them have different outfits on, but, but they're all very cute and appropriate for the theme, I think. Chloe's is really nice, um, you know, kind of got the black and white thing going on a little bit. There's a little pink in there. I love the skirt. The skirt that she's wearing is just so, so cute. I love it. Pleated, plaid. It looks like it's like a wool material. And then this is her artwork on the back. Awesome. This is just such a really fun line. I love this line so much. It's one of my favorites. Um, I'm going to show you my absolute favorite soon. And this is Yasmin. So this is her. So this is her in the box with all of her stuff. And this is her out of the box. And I love how they um, made the, the horse look three dimensional. Like he's in there with her. It is so cute. Her artwork on the back. Fun, fun, fun. All right. Now we are going to sell We Didn't Roll Horseback Fun. Now this is um, Brat's Kids Winter Vacation. And this is Chloe. And she is just adorable in this edition. I love, love, love her. I love the outfits that she's wearing. There's lots of pink and, um, yeah, like pink and purple, lots of purple. The sweatpants right here are just adorable, adorable, adorable. So, um, it says there's no fun like snow fun. That's what it says on the back. This is the artwork. What's fun about this set is that it comes with the accessories. So, um, she's got her little, looks like, uh, skis here. Um, yep, skis and poles it comes with. They actually come with a little keychain, which is neat too up in the corner so they've got their um they've got their like lounging outfit for like after the slopes and then of course they're wearing their their snow gear 
very cute these also come with two complete outfits um yeah so she's got the snow boots and then she also has little pink shoes so that is chloe this is oh my goodness is if it couldn't get any cuter i'm gonna actually put this down because it's in my way if it couldn't get any cuter this is winter vacation sasha she is beautiful look at her and i love the colors that they chose for her the pink and the green look so nice together oh my goodness i am loving 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 this girl this one was tempting this one a lot of times i look at it and i go do i want to unbox her but then i think i'm gonna lose all of her accessories and for now she just looks really cute on the shelf like this in her box but i love her sasha's such a great character to begin with and as a kid she's even cuter she's got the long braids so so sweet and this is her artwork yeah all right now i'm about to show you my favorite frats kids line and this is summer vacation look at that i go through phases um at one time it was winter vacation but right now my favorite is summer vacation um look at that i mean does not does that not make you want to go to florida i mean look at her she's all ready for some fun in the sun super super cute i love the colors and the outfits and oh how adorable are those glasses on her head and she even comes with a visor and a frisbee a bathing suit up here you got summer sun accessories it looks like um, suntan lotion water and a pineapple <laughs> how fun is this oh i love it i love it school's out have fun 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 in the summer sun i am loving it she even has a beach towel and a little beach bag just this is just yeah this is my favorite right now this is my favorite okay only a couple more things um well, actually we'll show you guys this is this i actually am probably going to take out of the packaging because the packaging is falling apart but this is costume party yasmin and how cute is she so um it says dazzling disguise classic costumes are cooler with a funky fashion twist i don't know how many were in this line um it comes with two complete costumes i'm actually gonna take this right off because yeah and i when i pulled it out for the video i was like you know what this it's time to take this off because the packaging just looks terrible so when the packaging looks terrible there's no point of keeping them in the box in in, in my collection i mean that's how i feel she is so cute look at the twisties in her hair so she um so she goes from an angel to a devil yeah this must have been like a halloween theme i'm thinking but i think it's cute which which outfit do you like better honestly i like the angel i like her as an angel she's so pretty i just love the style in her hair i do i just can't get enough she is so cute the brats are so pretty but as kids they're even cuter they're just adorable oh look she came with this little pitchfork too <laughs> okay um oh and she also came with a brush i don't know if you guys saw that but she came with a little brush that says brat kids i think most of them do actually yes they do that's one thing that i wasn't pointing out to you now we have brats boys kids cameron and um this is the edition that had the snap-on clothes i do have some of the girls brats kids um girls with snap-on clothes in my collection but they're not in boxes that's why i didn't bring them for this video but how cute is he i actually like the outfit he's wearing better than the second one but he's cute he's a he's a nice character cameron he's like the iconic boy character so yeah i have him i don't even remember where i got him um all right also i have some inbox fashions um some of these are doubles so i'm just gonna show you the three 
that we have. This one is really cute. Look at that. With the leggings, the striped leggings underneath. A little overall um, skirt looks like, yeah. Oh no, that's not overalls. It's a vest. It's a corduroy skirt with a little brown um, vest with a blue shirt underneath but the leggings is what brings all the colors together and makes everything work love it so cute and then um this one and this one is shown on chloe like our you know a, a cutout of, of chloe but this is cute and it's so chloe it's such a chloe outfit these outfits even come with shoes fun 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 and bags a little purse and then this one is shown on Jade, um, and it has a skirt, a sweater, and obviously feet, and a cute little bag. And it says over here, it says fashion pack for, this one's supposed to be for Chloe and Jade. This one's really fun. This one is supposed to be for Chloe and Jade. And this one, this one it doesn't say. I guess this can be for anybody. They all can be for anybody, to be honest. Um, okay, there's something else I want to show you guys. You guys may have seen this already in the video, but this is the Bratz Kids tandem bike with Chloe and Yasmin. How sweet is that? So I have this in the box and out of the box. Because it was so cute, I had to buy it twice. And I love that it comes with the dolls and the bike. It's just, what a nice set. And surprisingly, I didn't pay a whole lot for either one of them. Um, and, and I bought them both in box, but I did unbox one. And that's them on the back. I mean, how cute are they? And this bike, like everything matches so perfectly. The color of the bike with the colors in their outfits and... You know, and then you've got classic Yasmin and Chloe who are like besties and it just works so well. I love like that berry color with the pink. So pretty. So, so pretty. This is one of my favorites. Um, yeah. Uh, oh, there's one more thing I almost forgot. I almost forgot. There's one more thing I want to show you that I have in box. And this is Bratz Kids Big Kids. This is the first time ever Bratz Big Kids. So this was the first edition of the Bratz Big Kids. And this is Chloe. Um, and this is called the Music Stars. Bratz Kids Music Stars. And this is Chloe. And how cute is she with her pink and white guitar. And awesome, awesome. She's got a really cute outfit. She's rocking out. And then on the back you can see the whole the whole band everybody artwork of the whole band and she even has a cute little pig right there <laughs> she's got her little pig with her super cute very very fun very fun that was fun i love the brat so much i do i love mga they're just an amazing company that brings awesome dolls and they have been doing this for so so long as you can see and um yeah, the brats are a lot of fun. They are. I always I always love doing brats videos. I don't I don't know what it is. I always get happy and excited. Um there's some nostalgia there. I didn't grow up with them, but they're still nostalgic to me, if that makes any sense. Um but yeah, this was fun. Thank you guys so much for watching. Um I hope to see you in the next video. Please don't forget to like, share, subscribe, comment, and hit that notification bell so that you don't miss out on any more videos or live streams from me. And I will see you guys next time. Bye!